look at this view. There's our boat, not this. It's a good morning view. Let's hop in. Oh. First things first, get your shoes out. Whew, here we are. Here we go. Leaving by yourself is always a fun little challenge. Here we go. Now, let's get to the front. Ooh. No, 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 no. Oh, gonna need some cleaning. There we go. Pretty tight. No worries. That right there is the best skiing resort in the whole world. Free worry. Good job, Andersen. You saved my home resort. up this boat it's a mess seagulls are not my friends this happens pretty much every single time we leave the boat for more than two days so yeah i wish every day could be like this office on the water it is perfection in finland right now let's get going club mode so you have a big sunbed here one of my favorite features of this boat is that you can fold down the soft top here and you can't see it and it looks really good and like nicely finished i love those little details that someone has thought that it's kind of ugly if you just fold it there so let's make it pretty i absolutely love this but now i'm super sweaty and I should film the intro you just saw, so I think it's time for jumping. Woohoo! So, that's one way to wake up and start your day. Now, the boat is cleaned and uh, I just need to take a shower real quick and clean up myself after that some computer stuff and just enjoying the summer day so we here we are at Rappukallio the staircase of rocks <laughs> yeah as you can see there's like kind of a staircase here and uh, steps whatever from there it's around 10 meters down and uh, from there maybe five six meters but yeah here we are anchored up and good thing i have my drone with me but I don't have the controller. I left that home at six o'clock in the morning. So yeah. <laughs> sent to the client it was a reference video for an energy company but while I was editing that I had a great idea that I should jump there with this phone and swim all the way there and from there it's just a small little climb on top of there and maybe I could get a really good shot of this boat and this place 
all I have to do is to swim there with the phone and not to drop it because this is pretty much the most deepest point of Lake Päijänne. It is around 100 meters deep from somewhere here. But yeah, I'm gonna try. Let's see if we can make this work. It is kind of sketchy. It looks good from here. No problem. This is way more difficult than swimming. Ooh, made it. Now to the top. These things <laughs> with barefoot, I can tell you that they make a man stronger. Every time you step on one of those, I will be a strong man after this. Well, someone's had a pretty good spot for the fire here. I can imagine what it's like when the sun is about to set in there and you have the fire here. Wow. I mean, just look at this view. Blue skies, big lake, a boat, pine trees, cliffs. This is the view that Finnish summer should look every single day. Mm. Now I'm gonna head down from this sketchy path and uh, drive the boat all the way to the gas station, maybe half an hour. And uh, we're gonna have lunch there with Joa. I'm gonna pick him up and uh, then I think we are going wake surfing or at least to do some sort of activity on the lake. But now time for the sketchy part of the day, going down. Mom can skip this part. No problemo, senorita. Ouch. Whew. Whew. Yes. Back to the boat. Ooh. And yeah, you might be wondering what I'm doing, especially if you know me. There's this one guy on the planet Earth that has been like the biggest inspiration for me. Let's say like, um, I don't know, maybe could be like uh, eight years six years something like that like many 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 years and his name is Jun Olsson probably my friends are laughing right now but yeah he's like the coolest dude ever and uh, he like changed his career from skiing to to like lifestyle videos and when I watched those videos like from the boat in Spain and whatever I always thought that he has such a good memories from those trips and you know I have sometimes like pretty good moments myself too and I would love to be able to watch these again when I get older because you know photos are always nice but I don't know it's just something different in videos so I have tried like 20 times to get in front of the camera and every time I was thinking like nope I'm not that good in English and in Finnish there's not enough people watching <laughs> which is kind of funny because I do this to have the memories for myself but at the same time if there would be a time where someone would be interested to see this then there's like so much more potential to do it in English so that's why I'm doing this in English also to get better speaking in English because I want to be fluent like absolutely perfectly fluent in English but yeah I've tried like 20 times to film a video like this I have so much material that I have never edited or published because I thought it was too embarrassing because my English is not perfect it's pretty good but it's not perfect by any means but yeah I just had this idea that no it's embarrassing, I can't do this. But now, after all those years, I really want to publish this. So, I don't know, maybe I will do videos here and there and have the memories for myself and maybe someone can learn or laugh at something that I'm doing. So, yeah, that's a little 
backstory of this video, but yeah, hope, I hope you understand why I'm doing this. I don't know, it's a kind of a big thing for me. Yeah, now I think it's time to take the anchor up and head off over there. Get these out of the way. By the way, always store your ropes like this. It makes your life so much easier. Perfect. See you later, Rappukallia. It's real handy to get to the petrol station because you just have to <laughs> take this off because it doesn't fit, it's too tall if we go with this on. So every time you fill up you need to take that those bolts out and fold that. Really, really convenient. No problemos. Here we go. Full tank. Monsieur. No problem, stuntman yo handles the situation. You know what this means? It means there will be surfing in Finland. Surfboard, check. Captain, check. Yes. Then, time to hit the water. So that's it for the boat today. The foragast gives us some thunder and it's coming in two hours so I think now it's good time to get back to the dock and uh, we got some wake surfing. Now I think we should change the boat to a bike, go have a little ride. But yeah, it's been a good day so far. And the boat is ready to leave to the dock. We made this beautiful anti-bird poop system on the roof so we don't have to clean next time we come but yeah now time for next activity of the day best car in the world 205 gti 1.9 that's important not the lazy old man's 1.6 it's a major difference here semi slicks <laughs> Miltek full stainless steel X house system very good. Okay, so I went back home and uh, there was the thunder. Then I went on the sofa and slept for two hours by accident. And now my friends are already biking, but they just called me that they will come outside of my house and uh, we will go for a spin so i'm gonna take this bad boy but i just can't find my gloves right now so i don't know i guess i have to use some kind of working gloves or 
anything because my hands get really slippery if I don't have anything on my hand and we're going downhill like <laughs> So bike is ready. I found the perfect gloves and GoPro is ready. Now let's go outside and wait for the boys. how steep this is and kind of slippery Yep. 